Well, I haven't done any videos on space uh, in a while. I've had a few videos out there, space. Uh, and uh, like in my other videos that you watched, uh, some of the videos I talk about people that can see, people that see things and know things that other people don't see and don't know, and in fact, they aren't aware of it themselves. Uh, but in 1951, there was a movie called The Day the Earth Stood Still, and this is a screenshot of it. It's a very good movie. Uh, it was well done. Uh, but you got to stand there and think, you know, is this two story or science fiction? Well, is it? Uh, we'll go on to talk about that here in a second. In 1957, a spacecraft came down, a saucer spacecraft, not much different than the one in that picture right there, came down and landed in a field. The gentleman walked up to a police officer sitting in a police car introduced himself as Valiant Thor, and he requested that he speak to President Eisenhower. Uh, he requested a meeting with President Eisenhower, and I'm assuming after the police officer got done changing his shorts, uh, he probably made a lot of phone calls. But there was even a documentary on TV talking about that President Eisenhower, and I spoke about this in one of my other videos, this was at a... Uh, military base and disappeared for two hours and nobody knew where he went. Well, this is where he went. Uh, he was with Thor and these other two people are with him as well. Uh, and when he was talking to our scientists, he told them that he lives on the planet Venus. And they said, well, planet Venus is really isn't inhabitable because of the atmosphere there. He says, no, we don't live on the planet. We live inside of it. And uh, here's another picture of them. Right now, they're, they're in Congress at the Pentagon right there, uh, as you can see, addressing them. And here's another photo of them. Now, this guy, you can see he's always got his arms folded, and I believe there's a reason for that. If you look at the girl and look at her fingers, her fingers are much longer than our fingers. Uh, but all this is uh, very well documented. I brought this up before in one of my other videos. Uh, you can look this up. Uh, and as far as their clothing goes, people are going to question the clothing and the hairstyle and all that. We dressed them up that way so they would fit in, so nobody would notice that they were different. And I believe that's why the one guy in every picture has his arms folded. He didn't want nobody to notice that. But anyway, this is very well documented. Uh, anybody can look that up. Now, you got to be careful when you're looking stuff like this up. There's some people out there that put spin on it and, uh, again, tried to turn it into a religious thing. And there's one website that says, Talk to Thor Now. Or they have another guy down there that was a criminal with a crew cut blonde hair that they're saying he's the actual valiant Thor. So there's some, there's some bull crap stuff out there. Uh, but again, this stuff is very well documented. It's well known, not to most people, I guess, but stuff like this to me is well known. But anyway, again, you can look this stuff up and uh, do your research and uh, make sure you're, you're looking at the, the proper stuff. Don't be fooled by the fakes.